Adam 2-1 defeat in the uh, FA Trophy against Bedford Town. Uh, what were your thoughts on the game? Um, yeah, I thought with Commons, um, we gave a great, absolutely great account of ourselves uh, for you know, 45 minutes. Um, and then a couple more injuries, because we didn't have enough already to contend with. Um, and obviously a red card is a big, big time point in the game. But, you know, it's not it's not a time to, to criticise anyone half or the players that we put out there. The effort they gave for this football club I thought was, was first class and you know it, it, it's a time to sort of reflect on that and, and be positive of um, just how well they've done lately. Completely agree the character shown that there after knock after knock after knock and still remain in the game. Is yeah, a I, thought, I thought we had a big chance. Uh, Calakuli just left half time with his left foot, probably twelve yards out. Um, probably should you know score that and then it goes to 2-0 and then you really have got something to hold on to but um, it wasn't to be you know, it's not a, not a time to point the finger at anyone because you know as a, as a group of players you know I couldn't be prouder for the, for the effort they give. Like you say we lost David and, and, and Barker in, in the yeah. first 10-15 minutes is there an update on them too at the moment? Um, well I think David was like a sort of tw- turn on his ankle so, you know, that'd be too early to sort of tell. And, and Danny Barker's uh, hamstring was getting quite a uh, sharp sort of pain in his hammy. Uh, but, yeah, both of them players have been excellent for us. Uh, Danny's played so many minutes uh, for, for a 19 year old, I forget how young they are. Uh, you know, a couple of years out of the youth team. Um, so, uh, it's, it's a, lot of, a lot of minutes for them to get through. Um, but, you know, I, I hate I hate seeing managers just be negative and talk about um, you know injuries and stuff like that. I prefer to be upbeat and be positive and talk about the players that, uh, and the effort they give um, because I thought it was first class. This, this is a good side. They've beaten some teams at our level already. Uh, they're no mugs, um, and like I said, we needed that to be on our best and potentially need a little bit of luck as well. 100%. We've got to be positive and we've got Brighton and see we've got another game right around the corner on Tuesday night. Yeah. I know you haven't got the biggest of scores to pick from at the moment, but oh, yeah. what would the preparations be? Uh, yeah, we obviously have four players back. Yep. Um, obviously the, the lone lads and the ones that are suspended already. Um, so they'll be back. Um, yeah, so we'll just uh, assess everyone tomorrow, see how everyone's um, looking like. I don't think um, David and Danny are going to be ready for Tuesday, so see how other boys are after after today because there's a couple with knocks already see how they are and holding out and yeah it's it's part and parcel of this club now you know after we learn from today and then we're expected to go and give a bigger cab of yourself on, on Tuesday and that's what good teams do they respond to, to defeats and learn quickly and um, I'm sure this group will be no different well done thank you see you Tuesday Cheers. Cheers,